Hi everyone, I hope you're keeping well and staying safe. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Thank you. And also don't forget to like and share this video. And so I will be sharing with you in the next couple of weeks, five easy and quick meal plans, hopefully to help with the lockdown. And um, as a mom, I keep thinking, oh, what's for lunch, what's for dinner? So it is good to have quick and easy, easy uh, recipes that we can use. So quesadillas is the first one on my list that we'll be making. And it is a Mexican dish. It is quick, it is easy, it is basic and flexible as well because you can use whatever vegetable you fancy. And also you can uh, make vegetarian quesadillas. For me, I've gone through my vegetable tray. It's the end of the week and this is what I found. Um, leftover red and white cabbage, onions, um, avocado, green pepper, some spring onions. So those are the vegetables I'll be using for my quesadilla. We'll also be using tortilla wraps, I have two chicken recipe, like some grated cheese. If you're a vegetarian, feel free to leave out the chicken and also if you don't fancy cheese, feel free to leave out the cheese and just make your quesadilla with some sauce maybe. So. We're going to first of all dice our vegetable and our chicken and spices. I've also got some spices that I'll be adding to my chicken. Spice your chicken to taste as well. I'll be using peppers, cumin, garlic, ginger and salt and some seasoning. So to start with, so I'm going to be dicing my chicken and my vegetable. Next, I'll dice my chicken, my um, chicken breast. Like so, just in flat, flat side and um, flat chunks like right that. So add some seasoning to a bowl, a bit of cumin, just a bit of it. some garlic. Loads of chicken, like garlic, like me. Some ginger as well. Teaspoon and half of salt, or to taste. This spoon of salt. So we'll mix the seasoning together and marinate the chicken with it. So I'm just going to add my seasoning to my chicken and I'll rub that in. Marinated the chicken breast. I'll leave that for a moment and go start preparing the peppers and onions. So next, I'm going to um, just grease that, just a little bit, we don't need too much oil. So I've greased my pan a bit, I'm just going to add the pepper. So you just kind of keep stirring until your onion is translucent. So we don't want to cook too much. Because um, peppers are very rich in vitamin C, so we can preserve some of those vitamins by cooking less. So that's kind of ready. That's fine now. So I'll just pour that out. Yeah. 
in a bowl for now. So I'm going to grease that again. Grease your pan again. So you leave the chicken in until it's well done. So I'm just going to turn the chicken so that it starts to cook on the other side as well. So we want the chicken well done. So I'll leave that one for another five minutes. So our chicken is ready, it's cooked, so we just going to let that out. I'll put the cooker on and I'm just going to place one to tear up there and some cheese. So I've got my cheese in there. Just need to put some cabbage just so they soft in a bit before we're done. So just a bit in there. Be flexible with your vegetable, whatever you have, whatever you can find. So Put some of my peppers. Put some peppers. Add your chicken. If you're a vegetarian, you leave out the chicken, you just add sauce at this point and then um, carry on. So. I'm going to just let that cook for a bit. And I'll add my card. A bit of avocado. So I'll put a bit of cheese on top as well. And then place that over. Place another to tear up over. So I like doing this. I like I like rolling my wrap. So this is how I flip mine. I just kind of turn it like that and drop it back on, just so the other side will cook. Okay. So this is about two minutes ago I flipped this, so I think it is ready. So I'm just gonna place that in my plate. Voila, quesadilla ready. So we're gonna cut that into into a triangle. So. So we're having a quesadilla today with some chips and homemade guacamole. So enjoy, let us know how you get on, leave your comments, feel free to leave your comments. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like and share this video also. Thank you, until next time, God bless and don't forget, look out for the other four um, quick recipe videos I'll be sharing in the next couple of weeks. Thank you, stay safe.